Hello and welcome to a new broadcast. Electric Felix in the Jaguar I-Pace. As you can see, the screens are still not functional. After a failed CCS charge in Bretagne, in France today. They stopped working as they did many times before this. Uh, yeah. I, I rent a lot of uh, cars and I experienced this problem with probably half of all the I-Paces that I ever drove. More than 10 by now. What I wanted to show you is a quirky thing. Maybe you think it's nothing. I don't know. I have the window open to um, get some air because I cannot control any vent I can push the button for the air conditioning it won't respond so I'm um, it's very hot in the car it's 22 degrees outside but it's just yeah it's, it's uncomfortable in the car but yeah outside there's rain and because we're in France you cannot just sit at a bar and pretend to have lunch because that's what they do till 2 o'clock and then everything closes so when I arrived at this charger, hello, thank you, Brev car. Um, when I arrived, there was a Tesla charging up, and that made me very sad because he just arrived, and it showed like four hours of charging left on the Chademo with the adapter it was a Model S 100D, so biggest battery they ever sold. So yeah, I guess it, it wasn't my lucky day in that uh, sense and with the screen shut off and so now I don't, I don't have any music, I, I don't have anything really, yeah, which is too bad. I wonder, oh the HUD, the HUD is still working, well that's nice. Can you see it? It's flickering because of the frame rate. Anyway, um, yeah, what was I saying? So what I just wanted to show you is this quirky thing that you're in the rain uh, but because the screen shut off you don't have any ventilation anymore or you at least cannot control it. So you need to have the window open and you don't want to stand in the rain next to the car obviously. Uh, and there's also no bar because you're in a country where bars actually close even during the day after lunch. So what you do is you want to look outside because this is like the one thing you have left is that you want to look outside. But then you have the rain. Um, so you want to use the wiper. And I did that and I'm going to do it again. And let's see if I can show you what happened. Oopa. And then you have raindrops in your car just because... You wanted to have a clear view. We have a sort of a clear view. You can also see the biggest hiccup when using the wipers in the Jaguar I-Pace. Anybody driving the Jaguar I-Pace right now will recognize this as long as they tried using the wipers in the rain. Because this part on the right is always... Um, yeah, they, it's, they don't hit that part of the windshield correctly. Um, yeah, so you get some... Uh, moisture in your car maybe you like it and I especially opened this window because yeah because of how the car is positioned right now like if I would open that window it would actually rain inside of the car but as you can see there's no raindrops coming in um, but then you use the wiper and you suddenly wet your car on the inside so I hope I taught you something like I don't know what and I don't know how you, but then, you, well, you could close the window, wipe a little bit, and open the window again. Uh, stuff like this. And meanwhile, yeah, I have to look at all these motorbikes passing because, yeah, turning on some music, using the web browser, la 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 la. No, no, it's not going to happen. So, yeah, um, just checking in. Check out my other videos. Read the blog. Watch my Twitter to see what's happening in the live world. And see you around. Electric Felix, signing out.